Hello everybody, this is Pat Dennis with Eureka, and today I want to take just a couple of minutes to do a quick demo of how Eureka can work really well with field service lightning. For those of you that are not familiar with what Eureka does, we're a Salesforce native forms and assessments application, uh, and we're really all about enabling mobile workforces to be able to go through assessments, checklists, inspections in the field, perhaps while offline, uh, all while mapping information back to Salesforce and helping them do their jobs. As it pertains to how we uh, work with Field Service Lightning, we are able to jump from the Field Service mobile app over into the Eureka mobile app, which makes it great for, for technicians who are in the field uh, doing their work. They are able to just quickly click a button and then jump right into a checklist or an inspection form that they need to be filling out. We can map data back to many objects in Salesforce, but specifically for Field Service Lightning, we commonly map information to work orders and service appointments and work order line items etc. So with that said, let me jump into a quick demo here. We're going to begin in Salesforce and then I'm going to jump over into the Field Service mobile app. Then we're going to fill out a checklist on the Eureka mobile app and then we're going to submit it all back into Salesforce and review the information there. So if I open up my desktop and mobile application, what you'll see is the Field Service Lightning Dispatcher console on the left hand side and we'll see my mobile application on the right hand side. And so what we're going to do here is I've created a service appointment uh, that I've dispatched to myself. And so in this case, the story is I'm going to need to go repair an appliance that is broken down at one of my uh, customer's homes. So I'm going to click into this particular appointment. I can see all the information about that appointment, get directions to get navigated there as well. Uh, but when it comes time for me to actually have arrived on site, I can click this little button here. It's going to open up all my quick actions that I uh, have available to me and one of those is, is uh, in this case says complete form and I can click that it's just gonna take me over to the Eureka mobile app and it's gonna prepare a quick checklist and form for me to fill out so in this case we can see we've got some information from the work order here and we'll fill out some other information as we go and as you can kinda see as I enter some of this information in we're actually opening up all new different kinds of questions um, kind of guiding the user through their process here all this information is going to ultimately get mapped back to Salesforce where we can review it later on. We support a lot of different data types including the ability to take photos, the ability to capture pick lists, of free text, etc. Uh, and like I said before, all that stuff is going to get captured inside of Salesforce. Uh, and then finally, when we um, ultimately say that we're able to actually fix this issue at hand, we're also presenting our technician with helpful instructions um, that might be able to help them improve their ability uh, to actually do the job correctly the first time, uh, increasing first time fix rates and things of that nature. Finally, we're able to update our work order line items here as well. So beforehand, we were updating our work order and then all the associated information as well. So we'll just disposition those and then close it out by grabbing some client feedback and maybe say, I'm really happy with my experience today and then we'll quickly get their signature. Submit this back to Salesforce. If we were offline, the form would uh, just stay on the device until we return to connectivity. If we were online, uh, just like I was right now, it's gonna push everything back into Salesforce. Back in the system, I can actually go see my work order, which has been updated, and I can also check, check and see the forms that have been created today. So in this case, I can jump to the form record that we just filled out right now, and we can see the, the entire thing including all the questions that were answered, as well as some helpful insights like Einstein uh, image recognition and Einstein sentiment analysis. So that's a quick demo of what, uh, what Eureka can do uh, alongside Field Service Lightning. If you have any more questions, don't hesitate to go to our website at eureka.io or click on the videos here to learn more.